everybody, and welcome back to this thing. Thing we haven't done before. Yes, we've not done this. Welcome back welcome to the Welcome back thing. to the start. Yes. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. You're, you're already now, you're picking wrong. You're already picking on me. <laughs> it's just it just it, seriously, you're taking the piss. You know? <laughs> yeah, it's me and Corpse back again with another visual novel. <sighs> Male romance is active, Nicole. Nicole! Sorry, uh, for those of you not born in the 80s, that's um, a Renault Clio ad by Renault Clio. <laughs> <laughs> Nicole, papa! We had shit adverts in the, in, it, yeah. in the 80s, didn't we? No, that was a 90s thing. Blaming the yeah, 90s so. kids, because you were totally I... responsible for that. Yeah, yeah. Entirely your fault with the way that you were not anyway old enough to any way. In... Yeah! Prepubescent yeah, scabs. You should have been old enough to influence it to stop it happening. Yes. Yeah. It was in no way off. Or to be fair, eighties kids. No, it probably wasn't really our fault either. But with what being so ten? It's it probably the people being substantially older who are actually worked in marketing and advertising. Yeah. I'd, I'd guess it was under them then. Yeah. Plus someone who does market research, you know, oh. lying. Um, lying. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Any market research I've ever liked is the one that got me three cups of tea filling in a form. I like that one. Yeah, when I was a kid, there was there was this market research about toys that that some random stranger approached us on the street and my mum let us wow. go. She came with us, so yeah. Oh, right. I just say, <laughs> it does sound dodgy when I put it like that. <laughs> just go with the nice man. Yes, they'll give you some toys. We got toys and sweets, if I remember rightly. I was like six. I'm a stranger. That's that's nice. That's... I know. It taught me to take sweets from strangers. Explains because... a lot. Yeah, well, I've got too much weight on at the moment. Yeah, that explains it. <clears throat> well, you wouldn't have accepted your sherbet mail order last year, would you? I've... No, I've still got that. Stranger. You know, you ordered enough sherbet to kill someone. Of course, you've still got some. <laughs> uh, what have you? Got enough sherbet. To I'll make be honest. The person entirely out of sherbet. <laughs> only 30 packets um of which i've still got about 20 I, I, admittedly i probably shouldn't have sold you showed you that um any sweet wholesalers website no you probably uh. shouldn't <laughs> i did in fact go through the whole tub of fizzy cola bottles though yeah but they're fizzy cola bottles that's true that's true they're, they're, they're it's, there. A, it's a sin <laughs> yeah and if they're there you gotta fucking eat them um, waste them oh <laughs> That's <laughs> waste food. They like food in the loosest possible terms. Well, they're gelatin. That's part of an animal. Yeah. Especially of these fizzy cola bottles. I like having roast beef, but but wibblier. Yeah, but wibbly. It's wibbly beef. 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 Okay. Anyway, I'm starting this game because. Okay. Oh god. Oh my god! Look at that head. Oh, she's huge! <laughs> she's got a huge head! And she's got love hearts coming out. And she's got morale and energy. Oh, we're going to have to f keep her morale and energy up, aren't we? On wit. Yes. <laughs> she's, she is a shining wit, I can already tell. Amity. I've never I've never actually seen that written down in the game previously. No. Except on the what is Amity? Really Amity is, is being nice being to people. Nice, yeah. Oh, yeah. Being well, amenable, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. Diligence. That's why you don't count it very much. Yeah. Diligence and zeal. And clues. Wow. Yes, yeah, so if we <laughs> fill out that bar, we, we know who the murder... Oh, there's a... There, if you, those of you who don't know, there is a murder mystery kind of deal. I think it may be a kidnapping mystery. You have to find out who's stealing people's giant heads. Yeah. Whilst they're attached to their bodies. Anyway. Yeah. I guess this is me. There are already tons of people on campus when I arrive. What a cool place. It's busy yeah. and loud. But I f busy and loud. Yeah, look at all the ah. people. I find that makes the atmosphere yeah. more exciting in a way. Oh. Yeah, that, that person looks excited to be there. Yeah, she she looks enthused. It's nice that to know. Us? Sorry? She's very similar. I think that's us. But it, what? But the hair looks different. I think that is us. Yes, I think that's yeah. that's... It's just the big head one. You can't really see the ponytail. 
Oh, it's down here. I don't know if you can yeah. see it. It, we, it we, is there. We're screen sharing. Obvious. So, um, yeah, it is there. It's hanging down her boob. Yeah. Um, nice to know that nothing's different just because I picked a private university. Okay. Americans, what's the difference between a public and a private university over there? Um, yeah. I, I have no idea. Um, I'm going to take a drink now. <laughs> Professional. Thanks for some help from school. I have already most of my stuff up in my rooms. The only thing that's left is a single box. It's already been hefted awkwardly around in my arms. Now, you see, my Easy. parents came with me when I went to uni and then dropped me off and then... Abandoned you. Pretty much until <laughs> my third year. Right, bye. <laughs> until my third year where they took me back and then brought brought me back again, you know, in the car. No. So... I sort of... I'd be really tempted if I was one of your parents to say that just the following day or something you come down to go and you talk about going back for you and you get them, oh, were you gone somewhere? It's yeah, nice. yeah, I actually had that. <laughs> My parents are sort of... <laughs> They're about as facetious as you are. So, um, yeah. yeah. Okay, I really want to look around, but that can wait for later when I have more time. You know, when I'm studying and everything. Oh, she's blonde. I pick up my stride as I approach the dormitory, weaving past the other students as I go. I nearly crash into people who more often than I'd like... Oh. Oh, she's clumsy. I nearly What's crash into... What's the bet she walks into someone who turns out to be either a love interest or a murderer? I... Dang. Yes. I nearly crash into people more often than I'd like, but make sure to hastily mumble an apology to each student who has the fortune of getting misfortune of getting in my way. Uh, to be fair, if I'm crashing into lots and lots of people, that's or that would be on me, as a rule. Yeah. I mean, I don't like her. She's annoying. I know I should slow down, but I can't help it. I've been waiting for this for so long. <sighs> I worked really hard to get into this university, and now that I'm here, I can hardly believe it, and will stop working po post haste. I'm not the only one like this. All around me, I can hear people chattering. Chatter, chatter. My ears pick up at the mention of local restaurants teachers to avoid teachers to take popular media and a medley of other topics. It's your typical school talk. I I'll be honest. On campus, no nobody was talking about teachers to avoid or teachers to take because you got what you were given. Yeah. And screw you if you didn't like it. And as badly as I want to just join in with someone and make some new friends, I have stuff to take care of. But otherwise, that'd be weird. Man, already with the responsibilities. Oh, yes, the responsibilities of, of, of university. I remember those. I, I don't, actually. Most was... students can't. Alcohol joke. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm... I was pretty diligent for a student. Higher than 001, then. Yeah, I mean, you know, <laughs> it was just like mm. soon I'm in the soon I'm in the halls of the dorm, glancing at each door number I pass to try and find mine. I'm rooming with someone for rooming with someone for the year, Chandra Dawn. I think her name was. That sounds the name of a killer to me. Some kind of elf. An elf. Chandra Dawn. Chandra An elven Dawn. Paladin. Oh God. <laughs> An elven paladin. I was thinking one of Santa's elves. But, oh, right. um, yeah, I don't know much, all that much about her, but I'm hoping she'll be cool. Is this actually a thing in America where you actually share dorm rooms? Um, as far as I'm aware, it, it is. It is a That's thing. That's so weird. Everyone in my... It was just like, you have your own room. Don't fuck it up. Tiny room, but, yeah. Tiny room, but my, it's got a desk, it's got a bed, it's got a wardrobe. I'm, I'm, I'm fine. However, mine did have just painted breeze blocks on the wall. Which is when you were in bed, you scraped your elbows down them. Oh, lovely. It was, oh, it was top class university. <laughs> <laughs> Couldn't afford walls properly, yeah. Couldn't afford a real walls. Uh, but my what's day. plaster? Plaster is for the rich kids. To be fair, Plaster's my... for the weak. My university was the top university for what I did. However, what I was doing was geological and, mi geologic and mining stuff. So, It was a place with yeah. the most rocks. Well, it was in the middle of the old coal mining district. I, I was making a joke about breeze blocks being kind of rocky. Yeah, Not I know. Not really rocks, but you know what I mean. You know, well, 
It was actually naturally occurring rocks. Well, you say it was in the middle of rocks, but it was fucking in the middle of all the rocks. (laughs) You're in the UK. I mean, there are. I mean, down here it's all mud and clay, but up there there's actual rocks and stuff. So yeah, (laughs) I I know I'm, I'm turning people off, but yeah, I did rocks. Deal with it. Anyway, in the worst case, fanfic. (laughs) (laughs) Probably already out there, to be honest. I've stopped looking at fanfics (laughs) because. I don't want to plagiarise them. Um, <laughs> I've probably made worse jokes that are in the than are in the fanfic, so you know I don't want to. I don't want to look at them and think, "Oh, those are better jokes than mine," <laughs> because they probably will be. Anyway, yeah. <laughs> in the worst case scenario, I'm gonna have to switch rooms. But best to keep optimistic. I haven't even met her yet to completely swear her off. Oh, she's just hit a roommate, hasn't she? I gasp as I hit something. Either that or hunk. Yeah. I bet it's roommate because they're in the girls' dorms. Uh, I don't know. Uh, I gasp as it hits something. Visual novel. Anything could happen. Yeah. And probably will. Or really someone in the hall. We collide so hard that I nearly drop my box, but the unfortunate soul is knocked down to the ground with a pained breath. I'm not sure if that's a woman or a man. Looks like she looks like the person's wearing a bra strap and has breasts. So I'm guessing... Where is the breasts?! See the curve? No! The, uh, side, uh, towards, it, um, towards us, as it were. Like there. There's a slight curve there, yes. That doesn't... I thought that was her arm. No. And to be fair, she does have, like, typically male anime features. That is features. more of an anime masculine fact. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. I'm not convinced. Oh, I'm so, is so, she so trans? sorry. she's trans? I don't know. Maybe. I'm not one to judge. So, there you so, are. So, Judging the shit out of her just now. <laughs> well, I thought she was a dude. That's not judging, that's just making a decision. Mm. I'm so, so sorry. Are you okay? I clumsily place the box down and offer a hand out. Girl I knock down. It's girl. Uh, raises to her knees, are gently massaging her head. Oh, she's pretty. And so tan. I'm je- I don't think that's a tan. No, no, I don't think that's a tan either. She, she looks kind of um, Asian, I'm going to go yeah. with. Might or, be it. Might be. Quite dark. Right. Oh, just, um, some of the anime attempts at people of African descent are quite often not very... Whack. Yeah. <laughs> <Just remarkable. laughs> Let's be blunt. We can, we can, we're allowed to call people. We don't have to say African-American. One, we're British. Yeah. <laughs> what is the British term? Is it Anglo-African? Or um, Black British. Like, is it? It is, yeah. That's the, it sounds like a band. Yeah. <laughs> We're the Black British! Whoa! It sounds like a freaking punk band. Yeah. Actually. Well, quite a good one, actually. Yeah, Yeah, I'd listen to the Black British. But yeah, actually, yeah. that is that is the term. They're Black British. Or, as oh. we call them, Black. Or Dave. Or whatever. Or Dave, generally, yeah. yeah. Barry. I don't know why they'd name a black kid. I've never met a black kid called Barry, but I want there to be one now. If you're black and called Barry, um, let me know. Um, because like, comment and subscribe. Com- like, comment and subscribe. <laughs> Everyone, if, if you want there also to be a Barry, like, comment and subscribe. <laughs> if you like the name Barry, like, comment and subscribe. If you do not like the name Barry, please like, comment and subscribe. <laughs> Tell us how much you do not like the name Barry. <laughs> We will empathise with you because uh, um, we're we're fairly ambivalent, to be honest. Yeah, we, we don't care that much. But no, uh, really. Barry's of the well, world, Uncle particularly Black Barry's. Thumbs up. I did. That's another one that sounds like a band. <laughs> yeah, thumbs up. Thumbs up. Where is the question? No, but I'm, oh, I'm, I'm thinking. Yeah. I'm thinking about it though. I I did what? hear of somebody's. Um, once say once call a black British friend of mine African American. I'm just like, you're English. What? Stop what? calling them African American for a start. They were born in the UK. <laughs> oh. yeah. It is weird. It just shows how prevalent American culture is around here. Yeah. It's just like, mm. anyway, what what kind of voice does she have? Uh, oh. You only do two. Yeah. Oh well, yeah. Oh, she's Yours not Potsdam. 
I do. Oh, yeah, yeah. Do pot stand. <laughs> I do pot stand. She's, she's not pot stand. <laughs> she's not pot stand, but now she fucking is. I, I'm fine, thanks. Mustn't have been paying attention. God, I haven't done pot stand in a while. She looks up at me. I hope she's not in this a lot. <laughs> I just done pot stand for a roommate. I hope she's not in this a lot. <laughs> she looks up and at me. It turns out there's love soon. <laughs> I think there isn't because his male romance is active. Yeah, it could be female as well. Maybe. She looks up. Yeah, at... and you Yeah. She looks up at me and smiles as she takes my hand and pulls herself up. I don't have a big blocks blocking my view as an excuse. <laughs> I should have tried watching where I was going. I offer out a hand. I'm Nicole. Well, you did that. Yeah. But she's also got a massive box in her hands. So, um, on her shoulders? Yeah, it is. To be fair, I do I, I do have this massive phonics box that I have to carry around school, and that tends to go on my head and my shoulders with one hand. Because I'm generally beating up children with the other. I'm not, by Smack. the way. Out of the way, peasant! Out of the way, peasant! <laughs> Punting kids into walls. No, that does not happen. <laughs> Before anybody raises an arm, that has never happened. I do not punt children into walls. Into the floor, yes, but not the walls. Um, I'm Nicole, by the way. My name is Chandra. I told you. It's nice to meet you. Oh, God, look at that mouth. I know. That doesn't look like... She looks like a blow-up doll. What expression is that? She looks like a blow-up doll. What expression is that? That's... Ah. My brain has been removed from my body. <laughs> oh? <laughs> it, that's... Insert dick here. I am a sex toy robot. That's what that is. Oh, so I, I was talking about Chandra, sorry, not um. Oh no. <laughs> well, <laughs> she is pretty plastic, fantastic too, and yeah. she also looks like she, those are her gums that yeah. she's showing off, which also means no great blowjobs as well. <laughs> no one has teeth. No one has teeth. Well, you're right. Wait, did she just say? Chandra Dawn. I start to grin as Chandra and I realise at the same time she points eagerly at me because she lisps. Pretty close. From... What? Pretty close? <laughs> just just put that no, really close. Just pointing eagerly at me. They're about a foot away from each other. Just I know. Finger it's... in her face. Yeah. <laughs> because wedged into her cheek. Is your last name Grave? Because of course her last name's Grave. Yes, so that makes us roommates. Crap. I squeal excitedly. Oh, God. What? Oh, they're squealers. Well, hey, hey. Mm -hmm. uh, <clears throat> well, Chandra gives me a much more contained sheepish smile because that is not a smile. No, that is not a sheepish smile. That's an <coughs> that that's despair hidden behind it's the eyes. Of, oh God, kill me now, <laughs> please, please kill me now. Wow, Nicole, it's nice to meet you. Don't touch me. Same, same, except for the whole knocking you down thing. Oh, oh, that was an accident. Don't worry, I'm not mad. Good, it would beat the crap out of you if you were. Yeah. As if to change the subject. Sure... Go on. So we're going to make sure we're going to set our dominance over, over this dorm. <clears throat> yeah, we're going to piss on your bed. Uh, yep. Jandra just just take the side of the hall. Huh? To, oh, to the side yeah. of the hall. I can show you to our, over to our room. I actually have to go and pick up more stuff, but feel free to place your things wherever. No, cool. Thanks, Chandra. I'm not weirded out by this at all. I pick up my box and throw her off to Chandra as she leads me down the hall <laughs> and to the left. The second door from the end turns out to be our room. I bid her off with a tilt of my head before I head in. You know, go on, go off. Oi, fuck go off, on. kind of way. Go and hop it. Ah, uh, well, t I don't know about you, but it looks like Chandra's taken up both sides of our room. Yeah. Yeah, it's just, our room's pretty empty. No, it's not. That's a well-lived-in room. That is not an empty room. No. It's even got an Alice in Wonderland poster. Oh, fuck yeah, it has. I didn't see that. <laughs> but, yeah, she uh, Chandra Dawn has taken up both sides of our room. Um, Looks kind of like, assuming the pillows were there originally... Mm -hmm. Which be a bit weird of those script those things. The one on the bit on the left with a with the bag and book. She's 
there, but she's got her handbag on the chair on the right, so... Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> and all her books. And a second yeah. computer. So, um... Yeah. I don't like her. Our room's yeah. pretty empty. But that's to be expected. I give an awkward attempt at a shrug as I hold the box in my arms. I guess I have... The box so often in a visual novel. Yeah. I guess I have the room all to myself for now. Quick I bump... break everything. <laughs> I piss on her bed. I bump the door closed. Quick on their sheets. <laughs> I bump the door closed and s with my butt and set down near where I see my other stuff. I see unfamiliar furnishings at the other side of the room and I assume those are Chandra's belongings. It's great she got here around the same time. I like my space and all, but I could sure get lonely with no one around. No. I'm, I'm okay with nobody being around. I have to admit the room is pretty nice. It's kind of simple for my tastes. But there's a ton of space for me to put my stuff. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> sorry, corpse. I just... Um, went weird. Sorry, I just clicked on Skype because you, you were being quiet and that's so unlike you. Oh. Okay, that was being quiet because you were talking. Sorry. Well, you usually interrupt, and, and that's... And also, we're, and also, we're not using Skype to talk to each other. That's true. That's true. <laughs> you can shut up now, you <laughs> bastard. Yeah, I think I can get used to this room. I give all a of it. All of it, yeah. I give a triumphant smirk as I think of all those people who didn't take me seriously back in high school. A girl, like me, at a university like this. Basically, you're, what you're saying is, I'm not just an airhead. I am an airhead with brains. <clears throat> Everyone thought I was joking when I told them on my first choice school. Some jerks even laughed at the idea. Are you going to get some context about why? I don't know. I mean, I guess I don't seem like the type of girl to be complete brainiac. But hey, just because I'm smart doesn't mean I can't try to keep up with other things besides my studies. What? What? Like clothes. Like clothes. Ugh! You can study and be clothed. <clears throat> yes. Um, hmm. Plus internet makes following fashion quite easy. Hmm. Actually, I wonder if there are any sweet boutiques around here. Doesn't take long to log into my school's connection. Despite the horror stories I've heard about college internet, it's decent. I start lining up tabs on my favourite websites at the top of my browser. Oh, is she going to teach us how to use the internet? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Along with that is a tab of my favourite blogging site of all time. The one, the only, Roller. Oh. Roller. Roller. This is going to end up bit, this is going to be a recurring thing, isn't it? It is. Because they've named it. They've named it. And it's okay. basically a Tumblr knockoff. Yeah. Oh dear. If if this is a recurring thing, you know, she's got a blog on there, hasn't she? Oh, I wonder if we get to choose what goes in it. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you don't, but it would be cool. Uh. I have my music player going to. I hum along to the beat of one of my favourite bands as I scroll through the seasonal cardigans. All death metal. The seasonal cardigans. While well, I'm at it, season would be autumn and winter. Those are the only seasons cardigans work in. Yeah, pretty much. Oh well, I'm at it. I might as well be productive. I quickly make a new tab and type my university's name in the search bar. Of course, the first hit would be my school's website. Obviously, gross. Jesus. What? I, what? I really don't want to think. That was a bit out of context. It was a bit weird, is <laughs> not it? <laughs> I really don't want to think back classes just yet, so I scroll past and look at the other choices. Boring, boring. Oh, hey, a school newspaper. Also boring. Yeah. That sounds cool. No, it doesn't. I figure maybe it has some info, info on events starting happening at the start of the school year. On the front of the website. Yeah. Unfortunately, besides recap on orientation, which I really do not want to remember ever, there isn't too much to read. Orientation, like orientating yourselves like getting to your dorm yeah, so like this the is first... where the lavies are yeah um, don't stab anyone in the laundry please it takes a while to get stains out yeah and no peeing in the car park unless you're really drunk yeah oh hold the phone okay you can't hear this but the music's changed to spooky the music uh -oh. has changed to spooky okay hold the phone oh shit uh. <laughs> Multiple. Look hang on, I'm reading this. Like um, are oh, you do? That's basically an iPhone. Yeah, in a claw. <coughs> in a what? You hold your hat. You hold your phone like you have a claw. 
Oh, you no. Why is she holding it in her left hand anyway? Right-handed. Types of her right uh, hand. Maybe. Yeah. Anyway, the school newspaper, Multiple Disappearance Mystery Continues by Simo Littner. Multiple Disappearance Mystery Continues. There have been three victims so far. The police says nothing. Where was There's this? dot, dot, dot. There's this dot, dot, not dot. very helpful. No. Please rate the helpfulness of this webpage. Multiple dis disappearance mystery continues. Even I as find the most suspicious, right? Where mm -hmm. it says the school <clears throat> newspaper, mm -hmm. the big gap between the and school. Yeah, there isn't... It's like the, they've the, erased the, something. <laughs> yeah. The kerning on this. Kerning. Are they hiding? The kerning is not good. Um, <laughs> even as I read the title of the article aloud, I can't believe this. It sounds like some silly rumour the upperclassmen made up to scare us freshmen. Strangely enough, though, it seems credible. And the author even has sources and official statements from the police and everything. How weird. Official statement. The official statements is dot, dot, dot. Yep. Just go. It's just like, Read who that? are you? No, people. <laughs> Fuck dot, you. Dot, dot. Three victims so far. Each girl went missing for around a few days before being found unconscious somewhere in town, unable to remember a thing. Brain eaters. <laughs> it looks like each victim transferred out afterwards. Well, you would, wouldn't you? I can't remember anything, including why I'm here and what course I was doing. And also, what's a course? <laughs> Who am I? What am I meant to be doing here? Why is this le Who, what, what am I meant to be doing in this lecture? What the hell's history? <laughs> <laughs> I stop scrolling for moments as I feel a chill run up my spine because I'm particularly oversensitive to things. Air conditioners on. <laughs> That's so spooky. It's super spooky. Super spooky. Spooky. I don't get it. Like, can something be like that really be happening? Am I missing something? I absolutely yeah, number of students. See what I did there. I did. I wish I'd, yeah. I'd, I'd give. I'd give. I'd give money to not see what you did there. To be honest, um, I absentmindedly twirl a slip round of hair around my finger as I continue. Oh God. This is <laughs> actually kind of weird. And ooh, the police think this is a work of some mysterious abductor. What, you mean the little kidnapping? A yeah. A mysterious abductor. Ooh. <laughs> he gads. Oh, no. The police department is definitely on it. Yeah, yeah they're, on the, they're on the case. Just not sure which one. Past this police office, this police department. I finished the I article. I assume <laughs> it's run by Officer Murphy. And that's it. That's just him. <laughs> just kind of basically a 1920s stereotype for New York policeman. Yeah. Oh, right, lads. We've got to know. We've got to get down on this thing now. There's a horrible, horrific... Um, stereotype. Yeah, to be sure, to be sure. I finished the article soon after, but the details I read continue to stay in my mind. Because I'm weird. People going missing just isn't something you can ignore. Why isn't the school doing more? Why does no one seem to care that much? Because no one cares. Well, why isn't the school doing more? Like what? Yeah. <laughs> Female students, be more aware of your surroundings. Well, that's an easy answer. It's scary as heck. Plus, it's way easier to leave these things to police, like normal people would. Yeah, I just got to leave it to the police. Uh, be a little careful, watch myself at night, and most importantly, study, study, study. That keeps you safe, apparently. Yeah. I keep my face straight for a mere second before bursting out into laughter. She's psychotic. She is actually genuinely psychotic. Yeah. Or maybe I can buy this strike cardigan as my own start of the semester present. I actually, uh, I have a, uh, 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 I have a corkscrew on my desk, right? Mm. I, I'm really tempted to jam it into my eyes every time she speaks. <laughs> I don't know why, there's just something about her. I'm yeah. just really tempted to take this corkscrew, jam it into my eyes, and just, just kind of screw it in as deep as possible, because it'll yeah. distract me from her voice. And she doesn't even have a voice. That's how annoying she is. <laughs> I get out of the news tab and get started on my favourite hobby. Online shopping. I hate you. This isn't the time to get gloomy. I have a whole year ahead of me to get gloomy. Maybe things aren't going to be as picture perfect as the college brochures want me to believe. I figure... That's impossible. No. <laughs> I figure nothing is ever really as it seems at first glance. Oh, you worked that out all on your own, did you? Such a clever girl. Hey, if anyone knows that, it's me. Why? Oh, God. In the next room, you'll see several places you can visit. Each place, depending on the time of day and the day of the week, you're able to do different activities. Oh. Um. Each activity can lay one of the stats on the left. You find more clues about the mystery or simply refill your energy and morale. 
When energy and morale is low, you perform worse at each activity. In that case, go back to your dorm and rest. Right now, you can't do any job, but later in the game, you're able to work part-time yeah. to greatly increase the stats to earn money to spend. There are different endings depending on who you romance and if you solve the mystery or not. Try to see them all! No. Oh, God. <laughs> Cafeteria. A pub. There's a pub. Where's There's no pub. What, There's kind no of, pub. what kind of university is this? Yeah. Where's the student union bar, damn it? Okay, cafeteria. Campus. Please my booze. Okay, so drink something I'm, and socialise. like a student. Right? Yeah. <laughs> socialise and ask about the... Well, this is American students. They're not allowed to drink. Am I? Not oh. at 18, no. Oh, yeah. yeah. Classroom. Extra classes. No. Library. Search through old newspapers. Shit. No. I'm sorry. She's not being a cheerleader. Yeah. I don't like her enough as it is. Do some jogging. Relax in nature. Observe people. Convenience store. Buy a snack or check out the customers or go home. Do homework. Tidy up room or take a nap. A uh, campus, I guess, to wander around to see if we can get lost and murdered. Let's <laughs> just murdered. Socialise with people or disp ask about disappearances. Probably start socialising first so people don't go, who the hell are you? Yeah. Okay, let's socialise. That's, that's my guess. Okay. And we get one to three amity. Woo! Uh, okay. Minus seven. Minus seven. Yeah. Oh, we can go to a movie theatre now or a restaurant. Restaurant. Or the bathroom. The bathroom, which is separate from the... You can um, have a bubble bath. Um... Yeah, okay. <laughs> that costs money. What? Four yeah, bucks costs for a four, bubble bath. Four quid. For one bubble bath. Oh, ow. what happened there? Okay, no. How is this? Can I go back? Oh, I can go back. We're not having a no, bubble flat. bath. If we're going to spend something. We're gonna, let's see what the restaurant costs. Have a great dinner. Great dinner. We can't afford a great dinner. hundred bucks. It better be a fucking awesome dinner, is what I'm saying. Jesus Christ. What, what's the movie theatre like in this town? Movie night? 10 to 12 bucks. Okay, do you want to see a movie? What about exam and night activities? Oh, that's that gets you a raging clue. A raging clue? A raging clue. You want to do a raging uh, clue? Uh, yeah. Oh. Deeper. Oh, we can do more? Hang around in the alleyway behind it. <laughs> this yeah. is perfectly safe when people have been going disappearing. Yeah, let's just do that. <laughs> we're we're going to... Yeah. Oh, okay, look. Just, there are people. Spoilers. Spoilers. Relationships yeah. with these people. Kurt, Ted, Darren, I, I want to punch Jeff. Kurt and I haven't met him yet. I want to punch Kurt. It's those teeth, isn't it? He's the only person around here with teeth. He doesn't deserve them. Mm. Darren looks a bit... He yeah. looks like the stereotypically effeminate one. Yeah. Jeff looks I like... I say we go for Jeff because he, he's called Jeff. You like the name Jeff? Well, it's more because this is very anime inspired and he's called Jeff. That's <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, you got Ted like though. Clive. Yeah, I, I think Jeff. And You're also, like... if we do Ted, I'll just keep making Father Ted jokes. We could do that. We could do that as well. Just to entertain the very slim margin of people who get the <laughs> references. Um, yeah, that's true. Okay. Tip of the day. Since the amount of clues increased relate to all your other stats, you might want to wait before starting the investigation until you've raised them a bit more. Oh. oh screw you. She told us that earlier then. Yeah, like like before we actually had a day. Nothing is better than a good night of sleep. Oh, but I heartily disagree. Oh, she's wearing clothes, different ones. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, since it's the first day, this is going to be an awfully long episode series, isn't it? If we could just get through one day. Yeah. Mind you, we did start talking about random crap at the very beginning. That is true. Anyway. This has been Nicole, or rather it's been a very small amount of Nicole and us bitching. Yep. So, uh, yeah. normal then. Bye!